Hello, Internet. Welcome to today's video. Hello, Internet, and welcome to Weekly Rewind. It's highlights of all the videos I made this week. Some of them are fun. Oh, hi, Internet. We're moving, and yes, that is a cat litter box. Welcome to today's episode. Um, internet, do you remember Polly? If you don't remember Polly, you don't remember Polly. So start remembering him, damn it. <laughs> it would hurt my feelings if you didn't ask me. We have delivered the kitties to Uncle Jeff's house. How do you like it, little tiny? You like it? Now let's check him out. Everything. <laughs> Do you like it, little tiny? Okay. Jeff is letting me stay at his house until um, so I don't have to live on the streets. Yay! No street living. See? Although I like hey, street living. The bridge is just about a block or so away, so if anything doesn't work out, yeah, that right. place is just right down there. And right now, the cats are secured in your office. That's Thank good. you for letting us have a nice hotel suite. Yeah, you're welcome. And, and uh, Ponch. Yes, again, we are doing this move again. <laughs> this is my friend Polly. I'm here to do the knife and the fork, and he's using it on the pizza to make it slices to come. It's delicious. <laughs> Ponch, are you enjoying yourself, sir? Always, bro. I like I like everything you have on right now. You have representing the ducks, the turtles. Turtles. What, what, your pants are camo? You can't. <laughs> Yeah, that's the full burger. Hey, wait, let me see your outfit of the day. What are your shoes? Can I see? Converse. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta have the Converse, man. Oh. Hey, can you guys do a real quick uh, rap about pizza? Pizza was awesome here at this location. Uh, over here. Yeah, there we go. Yay! <laughs> How about pizza, pizza, pizza pie? I'd even let it inject my eye because pizza is the best on earth. And if I were a mom, I'd like to give birth Word. to a pizza. Wouldn't you? It's something that a mom would do if she could because pizza is great. And nobody in the world hates pizza. So let's start a plan and give everybody a pizza, man, and everyone will be happy and free. Just get pizza with me. Pizza. So uh, oh, we're back in the elevator. Soul. We're going down because we have to go back in the with the and get that. Oh, the pushing the pushing yeah. cart. Yeah. The movable. It's in the you know. Yeah. The moving the tools. Tools. Well, he needs to be able to push the machine going. Go down. Ground floor. We have to go back in the uh, to get the. Uh, you know, oh. <laughs> Did you get that? Hello, Internet. I am on the streets and because that's where I live now. Hello, Internet. So I had burgers with Yukon. That was a fun time. Delicious. I guess it's Burger Week here in Portland. That's a thing. I heard a guy use the terms, and this is descriptive of the burgers that we were having. Someone said the burger to bun ratio was perfect. I heard over conversation different things being used that I'd never heard before, like the flavor profile did not meet my expectations. So yeah, so my night ended early. Um, my friends went off to do other things and I was like, maybe I should go home and get ready for my, because there's a lot of stuff I have to do to uh, get ready for my next move. So, because I'm in Jeff's house temporarily, I don't know if I've mentioned that a thousand times yet or not, but, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, the, the place where we had burgers was kind of far away, but I thought, well, oh, screw it, I'll just walk home, because it's a nice night, and I, that, I need to walk off all the calories. So, I, um, I took the wrong street and I got lost, so now I called Uber. So I had the most embarrassing, awkward situation just now. Um, I thought this was my Uber, so I went to get in, and she started pulling forward, and I'm like, I'm so sorry, I thought you were my Uber, and she just stared straight ahead. <laughs> I, I feel like a complete idiot right now. Internet, we're on the way to a shoot, a thing, where um, I think not I might a shooting. be- shooting. Yeah, <laughs> not a shooting. No. Um, no, where I play, uh, bar patron. 
maybe. Which makes sense. Yeah, I mean, I've done that That's before. That's not too much work. <laughs> it's not out of my realm. You know how to do that. <laughs> so, You're a proven professional. <laughs> exactly. So it's Jeff's friend, and she has a YouTube series called, what is it called? Well, it's new. They're just working on it. And but, I might get it wrong, but I believe it's called The, the Benefits of... Gusbandry? Gusbandry. And uh, so I might, you, if you watch that series, you might see me in the background of one of their um, And a gusbin is, do you want to explain that? A gusbin? Or do you want to wait until later? Is a, a gay, like uh, the, the girl's gay BFF, but she calls him her gay husband. Yeah, and that's right? a gusbin. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not the gusbin, maybe next time. You know what I'm saying? You never know by the end of the day. <laughs> right. <laughs> That was fun, um, getting to be a part of that shoot. Sorry, I couldn't show you um, very much footage. Of course, it wasn't my set, and so I was trying to be respectful of their, you know, wanting to keep everything private behind the scenes and stuff. So as soon as I find out when the uh, web series is out, I'll let you know. You should probably just subscribe to my channel and watch every day, just in case. Just in case. I just got coffee at Fresh Pot, right there. It's like a, it's an old drugstore they turned into a cool coffee shop. It's one of my favorite places here in Mississippi. If you're ever in Portland, you should vis visit Mississippi Avenue. There's a lot of cool things happening here. I got some stuff for a little tiny and Nala to help them uh, relax while traveling. And um, <laughs> so, no, I'm not trying it. It's, it's not, I'm not like that. But um, no, because they have to fly with me on a plane. So I have to get them, uh, make sure all their immunizations are up to date and all that kind of stuff. So this place has everything in one place. So hopefully I can get all that done in the next couple of days and little tiny and Nala will be ready to fly. Well, this car is cool. It's like a 65 Chevy something or other. My mom used to have a car like that. My grandpa. Yeah. Chevy Malibu. at the pet store said that it's not supposed to get them too out of it they're not gonna be like zonked or anything but it just mellows them out so maybe I will take one I decided I could take a nap because I got so many things done today and then I look at my friend that's joining me for the nap this little tiny it's my nap buddy yeah she's a nap buddy she just look look at that cute face Look at it. I'm here at my storage because uh, I forgot some things. Also, I think um, we may have accidentally packed some food, so I have to throw that away because I'm sure after a couple of days it's not going to be. <laughs> it's probably what that smell is. I, I hope it's what that smell is. <clears throat> I found it. <laughs> the. We accidentally packed some garbage, and I'm not just talking about my stuff, but <laughs> I found it, and it is rancid. Oh, look at this building. Let me see if I can get back. See, it looks better. And there's a, 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 a palm tree in Portland, Oregon, and they don't grow here, buddy. Those, those are not indigenous. They're not indigenous. They don't. You can't get those here. So they had to travel them from miles away just so they could soak up the, the death. See, they're dying. That's cruelty. Palm tree cruelty. Don't be cruel to palm trees. Don't make them try to grow and in places they're not indigenation they did to. To nation. It didn't. Indigen. End. End. Palm tree. Hate. Hello, internet. I just shot a video. Almost was done editing it. And then I was watching it on a bigger screen to just check some things out. 
and I didn't realize how much cat hair I had on my shirt that I was wearing. Can you see? Can you see the cat hair? I mean, how could you... Maybe I'm blinded by the lights or something? I, I don't really know, but that's a lot of, that's a lot of cat hair. Okay, so this is uh, some footage that didn't originally uh, make it on, uh, I didn't upload this video because uh, there was way too much cat hair. So you're welcome, internet. The people that said they loved cat hair, you can only blame yourselves now. Uh, all right, uh, hurry up, Gretchen. I'm covered in cat hair. And, uh, I thought today that I would look at some of the trends that are currently twi twinding on Twitter. Trending on Twitter, and it, a lot of times we don't know what's in the news. Hold on, and you go to Twitter, and everything is hashtagged for you. So let's see, because I don't know what's going on in these hashtags right now. And if any of these things have been because someone did something horrible to another human, then I apologize. I'm not trying to make light of that. So Johnny Football. Uh, Johnny Football calls it good. See, and if he's dead, then I feel really horrible. Their uh, trend is the, the Browns, like the Cleveland Browns. Johnny Football returns to actual football. Well, good. I'm glad he's returning. It's something that... I am lured in some way to have to investigate. Matt Jones. What did Matt Jones do? Okay, there's two guys named Matt Jones on Twitter. And one is a guy that does the weird voice from that thing. And another one is a professional guitarist, formerly of Jimmy's Chicken Shack. So who am I to believe which Matt Jones is actually that trending? This Matt Jones is IMDb. Oh, yeah. He's, he's that guy from Breaking Bad, the tall guy that was the meth buddy, you know, with the funny voice. So Matt Jones is trending because, oh no, I hope he's all right. Uh, do you ever get guilty uh, if you weren't following somebody on social media and they die, and then you can't then follow them because everybody will go, oh, you just added a, a dead person. And that's weird. Please don't be dead. <laughs> okay, uh, what is the meaning of life? Wow, does anybody really know the meaning of life? I think it's you're supposed to have fun and enjoy times with your friends. And family, too, but friends. Sometimes you're friends with your family, and that works out, too. Enjoy yourself. Um, would you ever write a book? Y yeah, but so far, um, there's nothing interesting enough to put in a book. No, just kidding. I've thought about doing a book, but right now a lot of YouTubers are doing a book, and so maybe I'll wait a while. Who is your inspiration? My inspiration is you, Internet. You inspire me. No, but um, I, I do get inspired by a lot of people. I think anyone who sets goals and achieves them and never gives up, that's someone that inspires me. And I think we all um, have people in our lives. You know, my mom inspires me because she has a never give up, work hard attitude in life. And, and my, my family, my sisters, my grandma was always that way. And my uncle, and it's just, um, there are people in my family that are very inspiring to me. And as far as like uh, comedy, a ton of YouTubers obviously. And, um, you know, just there's so many influences and inspirational people around the world. If you're not inspired by something, you you might be dead inside. Wait, does that mean I'm not dead inside? Well, there you have it. Highlights of all the videos I made this week. The Weekly Rewind. In the links below, you can find links to the videos in their entirety. Or up in the magic click ball. That's always a place we can be together. I don't even know what I'm saying now. Thank you both for watching. I make new videos every day. Make sure and subscribe if you're brand new. Give this video a thumbs up. If you love things that I made on the internet. And I'll be back tomorrow with another glorious episode. Ta-ta for now.